Some of the most powerful boats in the world will again be showing off their stuff for thousands of fans that race down to Key West for an event that's unlike any other. I'm talking about the World Championship Power Boat Races. We are less than a week away from race day. Larry, thank you for being with me on the show this well, morning. Well, thanks for having me. Well, it's wonderful having you here, Larry, and it is almost here, the event that you have been planning for for so long. Larry, this is always an unforgettable week, but last year was, of course, a little bit more unforgettable than years past with three deaths occurring. Yeah. Are there any changes that are going to be made this year? Uh, no, the, the course is the same, the uh, same machinery, everything. We're just trying to make drivers more aware of the conditions here in Key West because it's a little rougher here than other races that they run in. Mm -hmm. So that's what we're dealing with right now. Okay. How many boats are involved? Uh, roughly 50 boats are coming this year, and they're all the larger super boat types. Okay. And we were talking a little bit before, Larry, and you said some of the drivers are from the East Coast, so that's a little unsure if they're going to be able to make it. Yeah, we've got uh, a lot of people are from the Northeast. Um, in fact, one boat... Um, the um, Qatar boat, um, they can't find it. Uh, it was on a flatbed and they're looking for it. So that's one instance that we know of. Uh, most all the other boats we understand have gotten out and are in, in Sarasota or Clearwater and stuff like that now. So um, that's where we're at right now with uh, participants. Okay, and the boat parade, when does that begin? Uh, that'll be this Sunday. It starts at four o'clock mm -hmm. and uh, we run right down Duval Street. Um, and uh, it's a fun event uh, you get to see all of the boats up close. Mm -hmm. um, and then uh, the best one that I like is on Friday night when we have all the boats on Duval Street where everybody can look at them and touch them and see the drivers. Mm -hmm. They really get to be mm -hmm. as up close as possible exactly. <laughs> with those boats. Now, where can people watch the boat races if they haven't attended this event before? Uh, the best is to go down to the Truman Waterfront. Uh, you can get day tickets there. Uh, parking is there. And then... Uh, they have shuttles, or you can walk out to the outer mole, and that's where the boats are within 50 feet of you. Mm -hmm. uh, when the wind's right and they're coming close, you can actually get spray from the boats. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. And now, how long does the racing last each day, Larry? Well, they start at uh, 10 o'clock in the morning. There's three races during the day. Um, they end up at around 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. um, so it's pretty much action all day long from mm -hmm. 10 to 4. Mm -hmm. And again, this begins on Wednesday, the first race. Correct. Wednesday. We, our races are Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. And it's coming so soon. And of course, for any more information on this, our viewers can check out the website that they see on the bottom of the screen. We're actually going to leave you right now with a video that is from last year, some wonderful clips. Enjoy the video, and thanks, Larry, for being Thank you on. very much, Jenna.